Hey Wildcats, I'm here today to ask, what can you do to stay safe on your trip to the river? The best way to stay safe from any drowning incidents is to avoid swimming or jumping into the river in the first place. There are safer options, such as lakes or pools, as they won't be as cold and tend to be calmer. However, if you were so intent on going to the river, obviously don't use any drugs or alcohol as they will affect your reaction time and decision making, leading to very dangerous consequences. Also, never go alone and make sure your group can always have an eye on each other in case someone were to get pulled downstream. Lastly, the safest way to enjoy the river is to stay close to shore. If you go too far out to the center, you can get pulled underwater by the rapid current which can lead to drowning or severe damage to your lungs. So go enjoy yourself this weekend Wildcats by having fun in the river the safe way. Hi Wildcats, this is Rob Manahan. I am your superintendent for the Snoqualmie Valley School District. I want to talk to our sophomores in particular today and share with you an opportunity to serve the district, your school, and this community. And that is to be a student rep on the Snoqualmie Valley School District Board. Um, we have five board members and two student reps, and each year a student rep graduates and moves on, so we want to replace that individual, and that's happening again this year. So to tell you a little bit more about the position and the value that you bring to that position, I'm going to pass it on to our president of the school board, President Carolyn Simpson. Hi Wildcats. Let me explain why we have student reps and how valuable the student voice is in the decision making the school board makes for the district. When the students speak, you can hear a pin drop. The school board listens to superintendent, administrators, and principals who really care about student voice. And some of the decisions that we make and why student voice is important are decisions like allocating budget dollars so that we can increase the number of counselors at Mount Sinai High School, and the decision when we decided to rebuild Mount Sinai High School, students were a big part of that. There are many decisions ahead and we want you to be part of it. We hope you apply, we want your voice. Thanks President Simpson. Uh, Emma Cullen, tell us about being on the school board. To me, being a student rep on the school board is such an amazing experience and I'm so thankful to have it. You learn so much about how a board works, getting to meet so many new people, and you really get to see how much the Valley cares about you as students. It's something that's really interesting because you already have parents and staff and administration all working together. So this is your chance to have a voice, a student voice on the board. So you really get to have your voice heard and it's amazing leadership experience. You don't have to have any prior experience with government. I had no idea what I was going into how board rep works, but once you get in there, you'll learn and it's such an amazing experience. I encourage all current sophomores to apply. You don't have to have a certain GPA. It's just, it's a great leadership experience for anyone. So I strongly encourage any sophomore to apply. Great, thanks Emma, thanks Mrs. Simpson. Uh, just as a reminder, this uh, opening will start on May 6th and the application will be open until May 21st. That'll be the deadline to turn it in and we will look at applications and do an interview process and uh, select the, the best person for the job. So thanks for considering. Hope you have a great day. Hope uh, this whole online schooling thing is going well for you and uh, go Wildcats. Have a great day.
the strength to play it. I need my coaches, teammates, and opponents, although I may not say it. Please keep me safe from injury as on the court I go. Give me grace in defeat and victory, your matchless love to show. Bless all who help invest in me, whose wisdom help me grow. I know it's just a game, dear Lord, but how I love it so. The other guys is this really, really funny, uh, clever buddy cop movie. It's got Mark Wahlberg and Will Ferrell. And I was about to start bad mouthing you behind your back, but I stopped myself because my pops taught me that a man who talks behind somebody's back is a coward. Wow, I actually appreciate that. Good, because I'm gonna tell you directly to your face. No. Who try to make a name for themselves as cops after two of like, you know, the big shot guys end up dying. What are you doing? We just handed all of our evidence over to the bad guy's lawyer. Are you a big man? Huh? I'm talking to you. What? You wake up in the morning, you say, I put on my big boy pants. Look, I'm wearing a belt. I got big boy pants on. Stop. It's got really, really funny moments. Um, there's this explosion scene that is super, super funny. So when I rate the other guys, um, I'd probably give it like a, I'll give it a solid 7.75 out of 10. So that's it for me. Peace out. The Mount Sa High School Class of 2020 Senior Moms Recognition Committee is selling posters to give businesses and families an easy way to celebrate our graduates. Please go to MSHS 2020 gradposters.square.site and order your posters by May 21st at 8 p.m. if you want to get them before Monday, June 1st. Orders after that time will be available on June 13th. Any proceeds will go to purchase additional posters and community decorations to celebrate our seniors leading up to their graduation parade on June 19th. Let's paint the valley scarlet and gray to show our class of 2020 how much we love them. Mm -hmm.